Hello everyone, how's it going today? I wanted to share with you an active spot for the the Duga Whitefish and the Wuxa Whitefish credits to Decoder. He found out the spot. I am merely trying it out. A big got a trophy here as well as someone else got a trophy. I am in Laduga the J as in Jack. J7 is the spot I am at. There is no clip. All you gotta know is you gotta use Wacky Rig. Uh, you can use a 3 to 7 kg liter. Uh, someone got a trophy, I believe Big got a trophy on a 3 kg liter. And someone got a trophy with a 7 kg liter. So I would say 7 kg is the max you wanna go. These are the exact same things you would want. I have a 1.5 gram hook as well as a 1.75 gram hook as well. I have alpha and a larger reel and I have a lot of line on them because since we're using tiny leaders, sometimes you will get uh, a salmon or something that's somewhat of a medium sight, so you're gonna have a hard time. And since we're using wacky rig, I will show you how to do this. You wanna face east and you want to throw in the general direction. You want to throw this, put the rod down, and then you can throw your second rod, but because I'm showing this to you, I will just do it with one. And you want to watch, zoom in with Z key and watch the line. And it's falling right now. It's falling, it's falling, it's falling. You're not going to lock your reel. You're going to watch it fall. Once it touches the ground, you pick the rod up, reel back again, and throw it out again. It's when this nasty worm is falling or sinking in the water is when the fish will bite. Once it hits the bottom, it's 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 worthless. Uh, so it has stopped dropping. We're going to go ahead, we're going to pick it up, and we're going to throw it again. And I'll show you one more time until we get a fish. Okay, just throwing it. Doesn't matter how hard you throw it. As long as it's close by, I like zooming in so I can see. The line is dropping and once it gets a fish you will know uh, there won't be slack on the line this is a technique i learned yesterday big thank you so much for teaching me how to do this uh very interesting very involved i would say okay it's touching the ground again so no fish at all and that's what you want to do you want to wait till it hits bottom and then you reel it in so now let's do this with two rods here, that one, and this one. You're going to get a lot of non-marker fish here, uh, but you will get marker, um, hold on, where's my net? Marker Laduga Whitefish. I came here literally six minutes ago. I already have a marker Laduga. Okay. Looks like this has hit bottom. This has hit bottom as well, so you want to reel it in, and that's basically how you do it. Uh, no clip, you don't got to worry about that, you need to worry about when the line is dropping and when you catch a fish. Okay, so the slack will finish uh, once you get a fish on. Like, uh, oh, it twitched. It twitched, not sure if it hit the bottom or if that's a fish. Looks like it just hit bottom. Okay, this one. Come on, damn it. When I'm recording, the fish don't want to bite. There you go, we got a fish. See that? See that? There's no slack anymore. Whoops, wrong rod. And there we go, we got a fish. Uh, is this going to be a marker? Yes, it is. Uh, looks a like whitefish. There we go, 949 gram. And that's basically what you need to do. Make sure your, your retrieval speed is on 50 because you're going to be retrieving a lot. Um, there will be some times during the day where you, where you will be getting a fish every cast. Uh, the clouds are making it hard to see. Thinking this one's already touched bottom because it's not moving. So we'll wait for this one. It's still sinking, so make sure the hook you buy or 
uh, the lightest ones because the lighter they are, the longer they take to hit the bottom. And I'm also using two different sized hook. One is a 10 and one is a size 6. Uh, so we'll give it a shot. Okay, we got fish on both rods. Let's see what we got. Uh, Laduga, very nice. Nothing big on this one, sadly. Is it going to be a marker, though? Yes, it is. 788 gram Laduga. Noise, 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 noise. Uh, 18 minutes. We have a few Ladugas and Wuxa. Wuxa, I'm not sure how you pronounce him. Uh, we'll keep on fishing for a while and see how it goes. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Fish is taking it. Fish is taking it. Okay. Is this going to be close to a kg or is this going to be 466 grams? 370 grams. Never mind. Nice. Finally, one kg fish, hopefully. Let's do this. I'm excited. Oh! <gasps> A 1.7 kg red char. Wow. Damn. That's a surprise. Okay. Another marker here. 7 and 96. You know what? Really good buy rate. Uh, initially, I was like, you know, you know, it's really slow. Um, but it has picked up 26 minutes. We have nine marker fish and a red char here. Biggest Laduga is 1.2 kg and everything else is under 1 kg. But don't sweat it too much. You will get plenty of 1 kg. Um, so this could be 1 kg right here. Uh, 881. But you know what? Uh, they are... Decently prized, so even if you don't get a trophy, it's fine. You will make up some decent amount of cash here anyway. Another decent sized. Buxa whitefish, very nice. Nice. noise okay one hour of fishing guys i did drift away from the spot without knowing it which is why i was not getting any bites uh so i moved back and look at this in you know six minutes i have one two three four five six fish one fish per minute it really woke up um but i stopped fishing anyway because it was a one hour mark i was looking for look at this red charge 1.7 kg 27 silver. We have 1 kg grayling, Wuxa whitefish, a Laduga whitefish, 1 kg, and then a few uh, non 1 kg markers. 150 silver in one hour. Um, you can do much better than that. I think you can easily do 200 because I did, I think, close to 200 uh, yesterday during stream. Uh, it's just that I drifted from the spot. So I was wondering why the fish weren't coming in. And then I looked at my coordinates. I'm like, uh oh, I drifted because uh, it was windy. And even with um, the anchor, I think I moved a bit. So there you go. Uh, there is a decent chance of you getting a trophy here. Um, very interesting fishing. I've never done this type of fishing before. So it was new. A little bit frustrating figuring it out in the beginning. Uh, a little frustrating, you'll get a lot of non-markers, but in the end, once you figure stuff out, it's actually kind of fun, but very involving, so I don't know if I'm going to do it again. <laughs> uh, so give it a shot, and I hope you catch a trophy. Let me know in the comments. Please like the video, subscribe for more. I'll see you next time. Until then, guys, enjoy. Hello, everyone. I just wanted to let you know that the channel memberships are now active on this channel. With two tiers, you can enjoy a cool badge beside your name or use emojis during streams, as well as exclusive channel on Discord where you can chat with me directly. 
Also, there are exclusive member videos released monthly as well. Click on the join button under the video for more details. See you soon.